What did they do to our beloved Megamind movie? I mean this is crap compared to the previous Megamind film, everyone is complaining badly and they have every right to do so. It still has its mean character voices like Keith Ferguson as Megamind, Laura Post as Roxanne Ritchie, Josh Breener as Olichem and the list goes on. The graphics of the movie is cool and never changed from the 3D animation it was known for in our favorite X-Villain Megamind. The poster didn't really do great like it should, I mean check this too, they are totally of different levels of quality and interest. I was excited about the movie not because of the poster I saw but because of the previous film so I was kind of expecting more. Now you see I don't know why DreamWorks Studio had us waiting for 15 years only to disappoint us the audience and fans I'm also a fan of you must know. They should have just left the Megamind movie alone to be a single movie than giving this as its sequel. Talking about the characters and costumes, dear lord knows that some of it was horrible. Example is the three guys dressed in a fish outfit, like come on is that supposed to scare anyone. Okay I know it's a kids movie but this second film was like I am watching a Mickey Mouse TV program, yes that was the feeling and you want to know why because the jokes and childishness was on a high level. Not to mention the new kid character Keiko Morita voiced by Maya Aoki Tuttle that seems to be appearing out of nowhere every time in a Megamind fan. The fight scenes are also not serious or close to being serious like in the previous Megamind movie. In summary the movie sucks just wish I could ask for a refund at the cinema. Thanks for watching, don't forget to drop your thoughts on the comment section, share, like and subscribe. See you in the next video.